beautiful day seven sunrise. Also real. Gonna take it easy on my feet, my legs, listen to my body. Whatever happens today, <laughs> I'm gonna flow with my Camino. Okay. Yeah, that's getting in there. That helps. Day seven. <laughs> oh, it was a slow but beautiful four kilometers. <sighs> and no backpack, might they? First time to send my bag ahead. And it feels so light. <laughs> Anything to help my leg. Uh, it's still walking. I just ran into. Um, were the Canadian girls, the loud, loud snores that I mentioned from before. <laughs> oh, I just ran into them and one of them uh, had this tool that she gave me a session on my leg and foot. <sighs> and it feels a lot better right now, it really does. Wow, so it's gonna be a short day and uh, keeping my good intentions. Oh, look at this. Do a little dairy farm, and yeah, it's gonna be a beautiful day. Okay, let's go. Look at this epic beauty! <laughs> oh my goodness, I remember walking this last year, and I said it looks like Ireland. And I spontaneously went to Ireland this year, so now I can verify. <laughs> Both extremely beautiful. Hmm, I think I'm gonna go back and visit Ireland again. Have you ever been? It is so magical. The statue for the pilgrim. Almost at 1300 meters right here. I think about the ancient pilgrim a lot while I'm out here and sometimes I how do they do it? They didn't have all this fancy gear and technology and good food and wine and nice, you know, comfortable beds. What happened when that ancient pilgrim got hurt, got injured? What happened to them? And if they couldn't finish the Camino, what did that mean? Their priest told them, you have to do Camino, redemption, your ticket to heaven. So, don't finish the Camino, no ticket to heaven? Ah, I am so happy out here in this beauty. Oh, my heart is happy. A week on the Camino feels like a month. morning I woke up to find I had been attacked by bed bugs in the bathroom I was comparing all my bites to another girl who also got attacked they got me good forehead chest shoulder arm hand back and leg what am I gonna do about it this is part of the Camino charm sometimes you get them sometimes you don't <laughs> Oh man, I'll tell you what, this scenery is just so absolutely glorious and I am soaking it up. The last chance I get sounds like for warmth and sunshine. And you know, I was pondering, meditating yesterday. I've now spent a week bonding with other pilgrims here on the Camino, creating friendships, getting to know each other, trusting each other. And I'm saying goodbye to all of them because I'm doing such a short distance. They're all going on to the next stage and 
I decided, you know what? Walk the talk. I said everything's perfect and I came here open-minded. So this means that I will make new friends, new pilgrim friends on the Camino starting today. Woo, there's a lot more steep vertical climbs in this stretch than I remembered from last year. Oh my goodness, this is an ass burner. And I still have a long way to go. Three kilometers to go. Today's walk is harder than I remembered. And I'm excited to finish. I'm starting to feel it in my feet again. So that's giving me reference that right around 10 kilometers, 10 to 12 is probably gonna be my limit. And I love being out here. Uh, I remember right before I left for Europe, my best friend was asking me, what are you searching for out there? Why do you have to go on another Camino? And you really don't know until you go on a solo pilgrimage yourself. The freedom, the peace, the clarity, the quiet, being in nature, exercising. You know, I'm not searching for anything out here, although there are some pilgrims who are in that state. For me, this is a vacation. <laughs> I'm creating. I love to create. And it is the most brilliant, mobile, mastermind for three, four, five weeks. Amazing things are created out here. And it's so much fun. Yay, I made it. <laughs> wow, big questions yesterday. Nice and slow, I'm in the tiniest little village, dairy farm village called Fonfria. I went slow, did all the right things for my legs. I'm staying at a, a really, really nice albergue. There's only one other pilgrim in the entire place. So that's gonna be a great day to catch up on work. Cows. And I think that's it. Just goes nice and slow. Take care of the legs, take care of the feet, and shorten distances. We'll see. Every day is gonna be a question mark. And uh, I'll take it easy. Keep you guys updated. Thank you again for all your encouragement. Buen Camino.